When I got this base cut down to size, I found two giant knot holes that I wasn't expecting that made me look like a suspect woodworker. So I'm gonna attempt to hide those to at least look like a mediocre woodworker. And how I'm gonna do that is I cut two blocks. Each one of the blocks is the same height as that row. Double side tape it down, marked it with the marking knife, I'm gonna come back with my router and just remove the bulk of the material. When you're doing this, you don't wanna go too close to the line. If you get too close to the line, it can be really hard to get your chisel into that marking knife line. And that's about right, right there. And I just take off as little as possible until I have no choice but to put the back of that chisel right in that line. Then I highly recommend just regular wood glue. If you use epoxy, it tends to leave a dark outline around the perimeter, pound it in there. It should be pretty snug, but you don't wanna break the other ones. And now to flatten it, I have a number of different ways that I flatten these, but this is a belt sander. It's a quick and easy way. And I think that actually looks pretty good. The first one, we'll see how this one looks here. All in all, yeah, I think I'm at least a mediocre woodworker now.